Hello everybody, my name is Paola Sarmiento and I'm going to show you how to record an audio on Audacity. It's actually very simple. The first thing you have to do after you open up the program and you have your screen ready here is to look for the recording button, which is this, this one that you have here in the toolbar in the upper side of your screen and you press it. Once you press the record button, a sound wave starts to appear, a blue sound wave wave the one that you see here that is actually recording my voice right now and this is the one that lets you know that you're actually recording an audio after you finish it what you are going to record you have to look for the stop button which is this one right here you stop it and then you are ready to see if you can you could actually record something and to do that, you have to use the next button right here, which is the play button. Let's try it. Okay, that was me talking just a few seconds ago. But this one means that uh, Audacity actually record my voice and is working fine. After you have this, you can uh, try to know to open up the volume, raise up the volume, or download the, the volume right here. We're going to do it in this part of our sound wave. We have this button right here that goes plus or down to lift up the volume. Let's try it. So we play here. You can raise the volume right here or you can down the volume right here. I'm going to put it on the half. Or you can use this one too. Okay, very good. This is the way you can uh, make sure that your audio have the right volume. Another thing that you can do is edit the sound wave here, the audio track, and you can do it by um, the way you can do it is by highlighting the part. They are going to edit, for example, right here. You go to edit and you can cut, for example. You can cut this part or you can undo the part. Also, you can highlight different parts of your track and go to edit and, for example, you can copy and put it in other place of the track and paste. And there you have an addition on a copy paste of your track. You can also undo this. Let's undo this. Another thing that you can do while you are recording the audio and editing is highlight a part, the part that you need, and you can erase it or you can duplicate it or uh, cut the limits or divide. You have many options to do here after you have the record ready. Okay. So this is pretty much what you have to do when you are recording an audio. It's actually very simple. After you do this, you have to import and save and make it on an MP3 file. But this is in general terms, so you have to do when you record an audio. Thank you very much.